we know that the relationship between the bank and the customer can be broadly classified into two types. One is general relationship that we have already discussed and the second one is the special relationship. What exactly this special relationship between the banker and the customer is? We know that there are a transactional as well as contractual relationship between the banker and the customer. These transactions happening between the banker and the customer gives rise to certain rights and obligations of the banker. These rights and obligations are taken as the special relationship between the banker and the customer. Means that when we speak about the special relationship, it is nothing but the obligations of a banker towards the customer and the rights of a banker towards the customer. First, let us discuss about obligations of a banker. There are a few obligations to name them. Obligation of a banker to maintain secrecy or confidentiality of customer's account. Let us discuss in detail later. And the second obligation is to honor checks drawn by the customer on their accounts and collect checks, bills on behalf of the customers. The third one, obligation to pay bills, etc., as per standing instructions of the customer. And next one is obligation to provide proper services. Fifth obligation is to act as per the directions given by the customer. If directions are not given to the banker, he has to act according to how he is expected to act. And next obligation is to submit periodical statements about the account to the customers. And lastly, keep the articles or items according to the instruction given by the customer. Now, let us discuss these obligations one by one. The first one is obligation to maintain secrecy. What is this secrecy? Secrecy is about the terms of the contract of the customer with the bank. Customer may have n number of transactions with the bank. He may have deposited the money, he might have uh, taken the loan from the bank or he must have kept some safe custody articles or he has, uh, he is taking some other services of the bank like tr transfer of funds from one place to another place and so on and so forth. So now, what is the secrecy? Now, whatever the transactions are happening between the banker and the customer, banker is not supposed to disclose andre customer matha banker madde yavde reetiya transactions agidru kuda adanna customer ge bittu banker bere yaragu hel bardu disclose maad bardu he has to maintain the secrecy. Yaake secrecy ana maintain maad beku. In case if the customer's state of accounts are disclosed. If it is disclosed to outsiders, it may affect or it may harm the reputation of the customer and if that happens, bank may be held liable because sometimes a customer who is a, a person, is a um, common man in the society, he may have some reputation in the society but he may have some uh, like loans taken from the bank. So, probably that is known to the public, yeah, public may feel uh, like that person is insolvent as he is indebted on tumba salgara on salagal jasti de and no abhipraya on a society ali barbohudu. Atra on vekti tumba deposits of bank aliti do adu bedar gota dre on tumba asa burka hanana marti dane and no keta bipraya kuda barbodu. Whatever it is, whatever the state of accounts the customer has, it is his personal and banker cannot disclose it to anybody else. That is one of the obligations and as per section 13 of the Banking Companies Acquisition and Transfer of Undertakings Act 1970, every corresponding new bank shall observe in an observe except as otherwise required by law, the practices and usages customary among bankers and in particular it shall not divulge means should not disclose, disclose any information relating to or to the affairs of its constituents. Here the constituents are customers except in circumstances in which it is in accordance with law or practices and usages customary among bankers necessary for 
corresponding new bank to divulge such information. Andre bank who yaude karanake other a constituent part of the customers details and a very yarbo code bardu unless otherwise it is required by the law. Kanun in a li adana kelidre atva bank practice a lay adana korbeka idre matra korbeko otherwise bank should not uh, disclose the confidentiality of the account of the customer. Okay, fine. Bankers, of course, they have to maintain the secrecy in case if the bankers fail, in case if they disclose, if they do not maintain the confidentiality, what happens? That failure to maintain the confidentiality of the customer's account leads to unauthorized disclosure of customer's account. In case if it happens, then if the if any risk, any harm is happening to the customer or customer's reputation, either financial reputation or social reputation. Bank or customer bagge bear or information kodo drinda, customer ge yene nasta adre, laas adre, adak ke bank ko hone garan aaktane. So, customer secrecy na banker maintain maadle beko, maadle dhul failure adre, banker is held liable for any risks faced by the customer. So, we say that any unwarranted disclosure may lead to breach of trust and banker is liable to compensate the customer for the loss of money or reputation. Bank may also liable to the third party if it is wrongful disclosure arms the interest of the third party. Kelo sir, banker uh, is liable to two parties on wrongful disclosure maadi dhane customer ge reputation loss agi dhe customer loss na tum kod veko. Mandwele aun kotti ro anta information wrong agi dhu a wrong information ga third party ge loss agi dhre, tundre agi dhre, aglu kuda Bank or third party go could compensate Marve Kagate. Hagagi, as far as possible, unless otherwise it is required by the statute, and the Kanun of Prakara requirement illa anta Edor could a banker do disclose Marbardu, customer account status and not disclose Marbardu. Okay. Is it uh, uh, compulsory? Is it absolute? And the Yavatu banker do customer uh, information and disclose Marle Barda, exception Silvandre. There are exceptions. There are certain situations where banker can disclose the customer's accounts information. Which are the uh, circumstances? See here, the banker is permitted to disclose an information under the following circumstances. The first one, under the compulsion of law. Under the compulsion of law, under banking practices, and for protecting the national interest for protecting a banker's own interest and under express or implied consent of the customer. These are the five circumstances. E Aido Sunni Veshurali banker who customer bag account bag information na bear ge code bahudu. No dana Yavdu what does it speaks about? The first one, the first circumstances under which customer banker can disclose the customer's accounts status or information. Uh, Modernly Sunni Vesha Yodanre disclosure under compulsion of law. Andre Yodadru Kanu no compel Madidre, Balvanta Madre, Otaya Madre, Aga Banku, customer ba account bug information in a Kodbokudu, Bere or Gay. Banks disclose information to various authorities, Bere Bere Adikariglu, who by virtue of their powers under the provisions of various act, Bere Bere Kanu Nagala Kelegade, Kelu Adikarigle, Sarkari Adikarigle. Power serate. If they require the banks to furnish information about customers' accounts, say for example, loka ekta, loka ekta yado andu vikti bagya ona earnings or thoran bank account status beka gatte. Auru bank na kele the information ho. Loka ekta adhikari ge aur act kele kade adhikarai the. As such, bank can disclose information to such authorities. It is an example. There are many such authorities. Atar deshton adhikari glu. Is on the canon in a calicade every day, a right to the a right on a pure risk on the banks and information calidre, banks and the code of the bank can disclose the information to such authorities. Sometimes, in any proceedings before the court of law, there are certain cases which goes to the court of law. Any of the parties may make an application to the court under the Bankers Book Evidence Act. Kelavu case really bankers books to evidence agi kelsa madate. At that time, only, Kerala, uh, uh, court, only case, I couldn't take that. Kerala, 
ಸಾಕ್ಷಿಯಾಗಿ ಬ್ಯಾಂಕರ್ ಬುಕ್ಸ್ ಅನ್ನು ಉಪಯೋಗಿಸ್ಕೋಬಹುದು ಅದು ಅಂತ ಸನ್ನಿವೇಶದಲ್ಲಿ ಇನ್ ಕೇಸ್ ಇಫ್ ಅ ಪರ್ಸನ್ ಹೂಸ್ ಕೇಸ್ ಇಸ್ ಪ್ರೊಸೀಡಿಂಗ್ ಇನ್ ದ ಕೋರ್ಟ್ ಆಫ್ ಲಾ ಕ್ಯಾನ್ ಅಪ್ಲೈ ಥ್ರೂ ದ ಕೋರ್ಟ್ ಕೋರ್ಟ್ ಮೂಲಕ ಅಪ್ಲೈ ಮಾಡಬೇಕಾಗುತ್ತೆ ಅಂಡರ್ ದ ಬ್ಯಾಂಕರ್ಸ್ ಬುಕ್ಸ್ ಎವಿಡೆನ್ಸ್ ಆಕ್ಟ್ ಅಲ್ಲಿ ಕೆಳಗಡೆ ಆಗ ವಿಚ್ ಪ್ರೊವೈಡ್ಸ್ ಫಾರ್ ಅನ್ ಆರ್ಡರ್ ಟು ದ ಕೋರ್ಟ್ ಪರ್ಮಿಟಿಂಗ್ ಹಿಮ್ ಟು ಇನ್ಸ್ಪೆಕ್ಟ್ ಅಂಡ್ ಟೇಕ್ ಕಾಪೀಸ್ ಆಫ್ ಎಂಟ್ರೀಸ್ ಇನ್ ದ ಬ್ಯಾಂಕ್ಸ್ ಬುಕ್ಸ್ ಫಾರ್ ಎನಿ ಆಫ್ ದ ಪರ್ಪಸಸ್ ಆಫ್ ಸಚ್ ಪ್ರೊಸೀಡಿಂಗ್ಸ್ ಆ ಥರ ನ್ಯಾಯಾಲಯದಲ್ಲಿ ಯಾವುದಾದ್ರು ಮೊಕದ್ದಮೆಗಳಿದ್ರೆ ಅದಕ್ಕೆ ಅನುಕೂಲವಾಗೋ ಥರ ಬ್ಯಾಂಕರ್ ಬುಕ್ಗಳನ್ನು ಎವಿಡೆನ್ಸ್ ಆಗಿ ಕನ್ಸಿಡರ್ ಮಾಡೋದಿದ್ರೆ ಅವರು ಕೋರ್ಟ್ ಮೂಲಕ ಅಪ್ಲೈ ಮಾಡಿದ್ರೆ ಅಂತಹ ಸನ್ನಿವೇಶಗಳಲ್ಲಿ ಬ್ಯಾಂಕರು ಕಸ್ಟಮರ್ ಅಕೌಂಟ್ಸ್ ಅನ್ನು ಬೇರೆಯವರಿಗೆ ಥರ್ಡ್ ಪಾರ್ಟಿಗೆ ಕೊಡಬಹುದು ಸೊ ವಿಚ್ ಆರ್ ಆಲ್ ಸಚ್ ಆಕ್ಟ್ಸ್ ಯಾವ್ಯಾವ ಕಾನೂನುಗಳ ಕೆಳಗಡೆ ಆ ಥರ ವ್ಯಕ್ತಿಗಳಿಗೆ ಮತ್ತು ಅಧಿಕಾರಿಗಳಿಗೆ ಇನ್ ಇನ್ಫಾರ್ಮೇಶನ್ನ ಕೊಡೋಕ್ಕೆ ಸಾಧ್ಯ ಸೊ ಇಫ್ ದೇ ವಿ ಹ್ಯಾವ್ ಫ್ಯೂ ಫ್ಯೂ ಎಕ್ಸಾಂಪಲ್ ಸೆಕ್ಷನ್ ಫೋರ್ ಆಫ್ ಬ್ಯಾಂಕರ್ಸ್ ಬುಕ್ ಎವಿಡೆನ್ಸ್ ಆಕ್ಟ್ ಏಯ್ಟೀನ್ ನೈಂಟಿ ಒನ್ ಸೆಕ್ಷನ್ ನೈಂಟಿ ಫೋರ್ ಸಬ್ ಸೆಕ್ಷನ್ ತ್ರೀ ಆಫ್ ಕೋಡ್ ಆಫ್ ಸಿವಿಲ್ ಪ್ರೊಸೀಜರ್ ಆಕ್ಟ್ ನೈಂಟಿ ನಾಟ್ ಏಟ್ ಈ ಕಾನೂನಿನ ಕೆಳಗಡೆ ಕೂಡ ಬ್ಯಾಂಕರು ಈಸ್ ಕಂಪೇರ್ ಟು ಡಿಸ್ಕ್ಲೋಸ್ ದ ಇನ್ಫಾರ್ಮೇಶನ್ ಆಫ್ ಕಸ್ಟಮರ್ಸ್ ಅಕೌಂಟ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಒನ್ ಮೋರ್ ಈಸ್ ದಟ್ ಸೆಕ್ಷನ್ ಫಾರ್ಟಿ ಫೈವ್ ಸಬ್ ಸೆಕ್ಷನ್ ಬಿ ಆಫ್ ರಿಸರ್ವ್ ಬ್ಯಾಂಕ್ ಆಫ್ ಇಂಡಿಯಾ ಆಕ್ಟ್ ನೈನ್ಟೀನ್ ತರ್ಟಿ ಫೋರ್ ಸೆಕ್ಷನ್ ಟ್ವೆಂಟಿ ಸಿಕ್ಸ್ ಆಫ್ ಬ್ಯಾಂಕಿಂಗ್ ರೆಗ್ಯುಲೇಷನ್ ಆಕ್ಟ್ ನೈನ್ಟೀನ್ ಫಾರ್ಟಿ ನೈನ್ ಸೆಕ್ಷನ್ ತರ್ಟಿ ಸಿಕ್ಸ್ ಆಫ್ ಗಿಫ್ಟ್ ಟ್ಯಾಕ್ಸ್ ಆಕ್ಟ್ ನೈನ್ಟೀನ್ ಫಿಫ್ಟಿ ಏಟ್ ಸೆಕ್ಷನ್ ಒನ್ ತರ್ಟಿ ಒನ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಒನ್ ತರ್ಟಿ ತ್ರೀ ಆಫ್ ಇನ್ಕಮ್ ಟ್ಯಾಕ್ಸ್ ಆಕ್ಟ್ ನೈನ್ಟೀನ್ ಸಿಕ್ಸ್ಟಿ ಒನ್ ಸೆಕ್ಷನ್ ಟ್ವೆಂಟಿ ನೈನ್ ಆಫ್ ಇಂಡಸ್ಟ್ರಿಯಲ್ ಡೆವಲಪ್ಮೆಂಟ್ ಬ್ಯಾಂಕ್ ಆಫ್ ಇಂಡಿಯಾ ಆಕ್ಟ್ ನೈನ್ಟೀನ್ ಸಿಕ್ಸ್ಟಿ ಫೋರ್ ಸೆಕ್ಷನ್ ಟ್ವೆಲ್ ಆಫ್ ಫೆಮಾ ದಟ್ ಈಸ್ ಫಾರಿನ್ ಎಕ್ಸ್ಚೇಂಜ್ ಮ್ಯಾನೇಜ್ಮೆಂಟ್ ಆಕ್ಟ್ ನೈನ್ಟೀನ್ ನೈನ್ಟಿ ನೈನ್ ಸೆಕ್ಷನ್ ಟ್ವೆಲ್ ಆಫ್ ಪ್ರಿವೆನ್ಷನ್ ಆಫ್ ಮನಿ ಲಾಂಡರಿಂಗ್ ಆಕ್ಟ್ ಟೂ ತೌಸಂಡ್ ಟು ದೀಸ್ ಆರ್ ಫ್ಯೂ ಆಕ್ಟ್ಸ್ ಆರ್ ಲೆಜಿಸ್ಲೇಷನ್ಸ್ ವಿಚ್ ಆರ್ ಕಂಪೆಲಿಂಗ್ ದ ಬ್ಯಾಂಕರ್ ಟು ಡಿಸ್ಕ್ಲೋಸ್ ದ ಇನ್ಫಾರ್ಮೇಶನ್ ಆಫ್ ಕಸ್ಟಮರ್ಸ್ ಅಕೌಂಟ್ ಅಂತಹ ಸನ್ನಿವೇಶಗಳಲ್ಲಿ ಬ್ಯಾಂಕರ್ ನೀಡ್ ನಾಟ್ ಟು ಮೇಂಟೈನ್ ದ ಸೀಕ್ರೆಸಿ ಈ ಹಸ್ ಟು ಡಿಸ್ಕ್ಲೋಸ್ ದ ಇನ್ಫಾರ್ಮೇಶನ್ ಆಫ್ ಕಸ್ಟಮರ್ಸ್ ಅಕೌಂಟ್ ಅಂಡ್ ಆಫ್ ಕೋರ್ಸ್ ಅಟ್ ದಿಸ್ ಸರ್ಕಮ್ಸ್ಟಾನ್ಸಸ್ ಬ್ಯಾಂಕ್ಸ್ ಆರ್ ರಿಕ್ವೈರ್ಡ್ ಟು ಫರ್ನಿಷ್ ಓನ್ಲಿ ದ ಕಾಲ್ಡ್ ಇನ್ಫಾರ್ಮೇಶನ್ ಯಾವ ಇನ್ಫಾರ್ಮೇಶನ್ ಅನ್ನ ಕೇಳಿದರೆ ಅಷ್ಟೊಂದು ಮಾತ್ರ ಕೊಡಬೇಕು ನೋ ಅಡಿಷನ್ ಇನ್ಫಾರ್ಮೇಶನ್ ಇಸ್ ಟು ಬಿ ಫರ್ನಿಷ್ಡ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಅನದರ್ ಒನ್ ಈಸ್ ದಟ್ ದೇ ಹ್ಯಾವ್ ಟು ಫರ್ನಿಷ್ ಇನ್ ದ ಫಾರ್ಮೆಟ್ ಪ್ರಿಸ್ಕ್ರೈಬ್ಡ್ ಬೈ ದ ಆಕ್ಟ್ ಆಸ್ ವೆಲ್ ಆಸ್ ಇಟ್ ಶುಡ್ ನಾಟ್ ಬಿ ಸೈನ್ ಬೈ ದ ಬ್ಯಾಂಕರ್ ವೆನ್ ಎವರ್ ದೇ ಆರ್ ಸೆಂಡಿಂಗ್ ದ ಇನ್ಫಾರ್ಮೇಶನ್ ಇಟ್ ಶುಡ್ ಇಟ್ ಶುಡ್ ಬಿ ಎನ್ ಇನ್ಫಾರ್ಮೇಶನ್ ಬಟ್ ಇಟ್ ಶುಡ್ ನಾಟ್ ಬಿ ಸೈನ್ ಬೈ ದ ಬ್ಯಾಂಕರ್ ಯು ಮಸ್ಟ್ ಬಿ ಗಿವನ್ ಇನ್ ಎ ಪ್ರಾಪರ್ ಫಾರ್ಮ್ ಯಾವುದೋ ಒಂದು ಫಾರ್ಮೆಟ್ ಇದೆ ಫಾರ್ಮೆಟ್ ಪ್ರಕಾರನೇ ಕೊಡಬೇಕಾಗುತ್ತೆ ದಟ್ ಈಸ್ ರಿಗಾರ್ಡಿಂಗ್ ದ ಫಸ್ಟ್ ಸರ್ಕಮ್ಸ್ಟೆನ್ಸಸ್ ವೇರ್ ಬ್ಯಾಂಕರ್ ನೀಡ್ ನಾಟ್ ಟು ಮೇಂಟೈನ್ ದ ಸೀಕ್ರೆಸಿ ಆರ್ ಬ್ಯಾಂಕರ್ ಕ್ಯಾನ್ ಡಿಸ್ಕ್ಲೋಸ್ ದ ಇನ್ಫಾರ್ಮೇಶನ್ ಆಫ್ ದ ಕಸ್ಟಮರ್ಸ್ ಅಕೌಂಟ್ ದಟ್ ಇಸ್ ಒನ್ ದ ಸೆಕೆಂಡ್ ಒನ್ ವೆನ್ ಯು ಕ್ಯಾನ್ ಡಿಸ್ಕ್ಲೋಸ್ ಡಿಸ್ಕ್ಲೋಸರ್ ಅಂಡರ್ ಬ್ಯಾಂಕಿಂಗ್ ಪ್ರಾಕ್ಟೀಸಸ್ ಇನ್ ಆರ್ಡರ್ ಟು ಅಸರ್ಟೈನ್ ಫೈನಾನ್ಷಿಯಲ್ ಪೊಸಿಷನ್ ಅಂಡ್ ಕ್ರೆಡಿಟ್ ವರ್ದಿನೆಸ್ ಆಫ್ ಎ ಪರ್ಸನ್ ಬ್ಯಾಂಕ್
and it should be in a coded terms. That is a coded terms only coded so that only a banker can understand, a fellow banker can understand, and the layman, and the third party, or the node, or the other information na disclose martha. So this is about the second circumstances that is uh, information disclosed under the banking practices. Third one. For protecting national interest, this is very very important and many acts have also made it compulsory on the part of the banks to disclose the information of the customer's account in case if one the customer do transactions who transfer of money to an suspected person so suspected accounts to enemy countries who the other countries gather the anuman as per the particular customer uh, transactions martha idane anta anumana bandre so such transactions may lead to the uh, i mean it may affect the national interest deshada hitasaktige dakke agutte anta gottadre antaha sanniveshalalli bankaru adana disclose maadabodu information na disclose maadabodu so let us see banker can disclose the state of affairs of the customer's account if it is contrary to the interest of the nation under the following circumstances. Yeah, we have a Sanivashalli banker ge e particular Vektiya account to Deshada Hita Saktige Dakya Gutte and Tansute Andre. First one, disclosure of the account where money is kept for extreme political purposes in contravening the provisions of any law. Yaude Kanu Nige Virodavagi political purposes ge Hanana Vekti use Martha Dane Upyogusta Dane and Ta Banker Gamana Ke Bandre. Author the account bage, author the customer bage, banker has to disclose information. Number two, disclosure of the account on unlawful association. On the way, Kanunu Bahira Vectical Jotelli in Sambanda Andre transactions it condidre Anta Adu Bank Ge Kandu Bandre. So, bank in Madhve Kandre, author of the vectical account bage information na sarkarake sellis pe kagutte. It has to disclose to the government. And the third situation is disclosure of the account of a revolutionary or terrorist body to avert danger to the state. Ondu vele terrorist rule atwa revolutionary body se na account na maintain marthi dure. Aahana upyogus kondu if it is causing danger, threat to the state andre nama desha atwa rajya ke transactions in the banker ke kandu bandre. If the banker suspects this particular operation is going to cause danger or threat to the peace of the country or the state, he must inform the information of the account to the concerned authorities of the government. Next is disclosure of the account of an enemy in time of war. Here the enemy means the citizen of other countries. Uh, citizens of other countries can, uh, cannot be enemies all the time. And the bare deshada citizens who namma deshada bank lali account an open maadi operate maad maad bohudu. Ella bare deshada ella citizens who namge enemies agalla. Adre in case yava deshada citizen no na bank lali account an etti dhane a citizen no country ge jotele namma deshada yuddha praram badre. Atwa if our country consider that particular country as an enemy country then onwards that person's account should be disclosed to the government. Yakandre a vekti by opening and operating the account may cause harm to the interest of the country. Atara agodana tadili koskara banks who information in a government ge sells bekagte. And the next one is disclosure of the account where sizable funds are received from foreign countries anta eltare. If in case if very large amounts, unreasonably, unreasonably huge amounts are received to any account, then banker can suspect that this amount may not be a legal funds, may be for some illegal purposes. If he suspects that, he has to inform it to the government authorities. So these are the situations where the banker has to inform uh, the information of the customer's account to the government authorities in order to protect the interest of the nation. And the next situation or next reason for protecting bankers own interest. 
if the banker has to uh, uh, protect his own interest, there are certain situations where the account uh, status of, uh, I mean, information of the customer's account may cause harm to the banker's uh, business itself. In such cases, a banker is not compelled to maintain the secrecy of customer's account when his, his own interest is at stake. Under the following instances, the banker can disclose the secrecy of customer's account to safeguard his own interest. Auna swa ita sakti ge, banker swa ita sakti ge dakke aguva sanni veshilalli bankaru customer account secrecy and a disclose maad bodu. Yao do do. When the customer has failed to repay the loan, the banker can disclose the account of customer to guarantor. Now, banker lalli ke lasari nod bodu. Yar yaru saala na kotti ra dilvo, andre time, expiry time ago girette, adre innu customeru Anana repay Madi Radila and Ravu default Agritane and Radu bad debt Agirate. Athar a default customer the Kelo banks a lee photo address some meta display Madita Inta Vecti Istron Salana Kodbe Kagidenta. Such a kind of disclosure definitely will harm the reputation of the customer. Adre customer reputation of protect Madakodre, banker gay Hana never Rodilla. So banker on Hana collect Madakoskara. Customer reputation na hard aldro parva gilla un disclose martha ne. Ya kendra un hana un gopas barbeko. So in this case, when the bank uh, customer fails to repay the loan amount, banker may disclose the account of the customer either to the guarantor or to the public sometimes. And when banks has to defend any of its previous actions like dishonor of check etc. Kelo sir yena agritha ne. X issues a check for rupees fifty thousand to Y. Why ye check to conductane bank ali present martane, but to check a designer agate. Ya kagatendre, ex account ali fifty thousand rupees irala, insufficient funds irate. Atava, ex account ali fifty thousand irate, but to exu banker ge, bear a sala kodbe karate, adan kodavurgu, e dudana kodalanta bankaru, ban maditane, tade edirtane, for feet maditane. Anta sunny veshulali, why keltan a banker ge, ya ke check and a honor martilanta. Such cases, banker has to disclose the fact to the why. Why is a third party, but still banker has to disclose because he has to give the reason why the check is being dishonored. Hana ide adre a hana na bere yaudu loan ge adjust madbe kage de. Atwa hana kadme ide nimge chakkali rostana koda kili agadila anta helbe kage de. That is a situation where banker has to. like disclose the interest to protect his own interest and the second one is the second obligation the first obligation now we have finished obligation to honor the check so now we are going to the second obligation obligation to provide proper accounts so banker is obligated to provide the proper accounts of the customer let us see, banks are under duty bound to provide proper accounts to the customer of all the transactions done by him. Banker is required to submit a statement of accounts, maybe in the form of passbook or in the statement. It must contain that format or the statement must contain all the debits and all the credits of the account. If the banker fails, then customer may not get the information about his own account. So, at any time, Whenever the customer requests or asks for the information, banker without fail must submit uh, the I mean accounts uh, information about the accounts. Next third obligation of the banker towards the customer is obligation to honor the checks. This is a very very important obligation. In case if the banker fails in this regard, e vishudali banker failure adre, probably banker may have to face uh, very strong repercussions. Andre, onu chakna honor madodali on failure adre, kelo sari serious samasegalena, onu gambir vada samasegalena, idhar spekagate. Kelo sari chakka mon bari aidnu rupai saur rupai chakna design wrongful agi designer madbita glu. Lakshantra rupai compensation code on Takas and Nivishal code of banker give birthday. Other Nodana Munde. Now, let us see what is this obligation to honor the checks. As banking means accepting of deposits withdrawable by check, draft, or, or otherwise, the banker is duty bound to honor checks 
issued by the customers on their accounts. We know that banker accepts the deposits repayable on demand. Demand hagi marthane customer either by issuing the check or draft or any other kinds of orders. Here, a customer of a bank whose check was wrongly dishonored, and they know whenever customer demands for the repayment through the checks, check kotritane, and they are taunu demanding for repayment. Adana honor marbekagir obligation of banker gay de, one the way lay by default, by mistake, gotti ladeno, gotti do, by negligence, no. Banker in Adru, author the checkana, designer madre, andre, check mele hana koda ke reject madre, refuse madre. He may have to face the uh, claims for defamation and breach of contract together in one single action. Andre on mele, uh, mananasta, mokadame, jotege, adrinda agata kanta, financial loss. Eradukuku, ku sir, see, customer case and na akbuhudu. Adake. Section 31 of Negotiable Instrument Act of 1881 specifies the liability of the drawee of a check. Illi drawee of a check and re drawer yaru. Yar check and a baritana on drawer. Yar mele check and a baritana on drawee. Always drawee is a bank. Drawer is the customer. Customer check baritana. Yar mele check baritana re bank mele. Illi drawee of a check and re banker. As per section 31, the drawee of a check having Sufficient funds of the drawer in his hands, properly applicable to the payment of such check, must to pay the check when duly required to do so. Andre inartha, banker ru customer do sufficient funds na it kondu, all funds ru a payment ke applicable ago tarai dre. Andra payment madakke sadhya ago tarai dre. Banker ru without fail, aatar check karna honor madle beko. Andre adar mele amount na pay mad beko. One vele and in default, one vele no default adre, failure adre of such payment must compensate the drawer for any loss or damage caused by such default. Athar da uh, idhar inda ena ro damage athar loss adre, adena bank karu tum korbe kagate, loss na tum korbe kagate, anta negotiable instrument act idhte. Now, of course, banker has to honor the checks written by the customer. But there are certain conditions. Customer has to fulfill the following conditions. Atwa customer's account status must fulfill the following conditions. Kelo conditions na fulfill adre matra, our requirements fulfill adre matra ne banker honor marbe kagate. Otherwise, banker can dishonor or refuse to make the payment on the check. Which are such conditions? Let us see. The first one is that check must be properly drawn and he is in order in all respects. Andre negotiable instrument act to on the check ko hag irbe ko check mele ena la information irbe ko check na yathara draw maadi irbe ko yathara bardi irbe ko anta heli the. Adar prakara check na draw maadi dre matra banker ro a check mele hana korbe kagatte. Otherwise banker need not to honor the check. Which are all the requirements to be uh, filled in the check? Ena la fill maadi irbe kagatte. It should be properly dated. Properly dated until the other male date or beku, month or beku, year or beku. Purti idra matane properly date. On the late date or month or put year or day idre, month or year or put to date or day idre, at the day to year or key month or day idre, yaudil day idru kuda, banker or than improperly dated chakanta, other than a dishonor madabadu. Adetarane amounts and now words mate figure ali clear agi held the beku. But the amount in words and figures must be matching. One way, amount to figures only thousand rupees and tied do, words only ten thousand and tied re. Atro vice versa. Bere bere idre, banker adana reject martane. Adetarane, the check should not, nigh, should neither stale nor post dated nor mutilated check and theltane. Here is the stale check and re. Yade on the check who baradadman, say for example. Wandu, Wandu, Eresa or the Hadanedu, one net ariku, one net thing, Luresa or the Hadanedu, data ki check and a barthivi. Alinda Muru thingla valagade, checku is good for payment. After the expiry of the three months, a ninety days Mugudod mele, Adan Nanavu, po in the stale check and the healthy expiry check. Stale agidre, a three months agodre, bank can refuse to pay on that particular check. Adetarane, Check must not, also, must not also contain a post date. Here is the post date. Too. Say we are presenting the check for payment on 1 1 2015. 
ಆದರೆ ಚೆಕ್ ಮೇಲೆ ಟೂ ಒನ್ ಟೂ ತೌಸಂಡ್ ಫಿಫ್ಟೀನ್ ಅಂತ ಇದೆ ಅಂದರೆ ನೆಕ್ಸ್ಟ್ ಡೇಟ್ ಇದೆ ಕಮಿಂಗ್ ಡೇಟ್ ಇದೆ ಸೊ ಅದನ್ನು ನಾವು ಪೋಸ್ಟ್ ಡೇಟೆಡ್ ಅಂತ ಹೇಳ್ತೀವಿ ಇಫ್ ದ ಚೆಕ್ ಈಸ್ ಕಂಟೈನಿಂಗ್ ದ ಡೇಟ್ ಎಟ್ ಟು ಕಮ್ ದೆನ್ ಬ್ಯಾಂಕರ್ ಕೆನ್ ರಿಜೆಕ್ಟ್ ಆರ್ ಡಿಸಾನರ್ ದಟ್ ಕೈಂಡ್ ಆಫ್ ಚೆಕ್ ಸ್ಟೇಟಿಂಗ್ ದಟ್ ಇಟ್ ಈಸ್ ಎ ಪೋಸ್ಟ್ ಡೇಟೆಡ್ ಚೆಕ್ ಅದೇ ಥರನೇ ಚೆಕ್ ಶುಡ್ ನಾಟ್ ಬಿ ಮ್ಯುಟಿಲೇಟೆಡ್ ಚೆಕ್ ಮ್ಯುಟಿಲೇಟೆಡ್ ಅಂದರೆ ಅದು ಹರಿದೋಗಿರಬಾರ್ದು ಅದನ್ನು ಹಾಳು ಮಾಡಿರಬಾರ್ದು ಇಟ್ ಶುಡ್ ಬಿ ಎ ಪ್ರಾಪರ್ಲಿ ವಿಸಿಬಲ್ ಅದನ್ನು ನೋಡೋಕ್ಕೆ ಸಹ ಆಗಬೇಕು ಎಲ್ಲಿ ಕೂಡ ಅದನ್ನು ಹರಿದೋಗಿರಬಾರ್ದು ಆ ಥರ ಇದ್ದರೆ ಕೂಡ ಬ್ಯಾಂಕ್ ರಿಜೆಕ್ಟ್ ಮಾಡ್ತಾನೆ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಮೋರ್ ಇಂಪಾರ್ಟೆಂಟ್ ದ ಸಿಗ್ನೇಚರ್ ಆಫ್ ದ ಅಕೌಂಟ್ ಹೋಲ್ಡರ್ ಮಟ್ ಮಸ್ಟ್ ಟ್ಯಾಲಿ ವಿತ್ ದ ಸ್ಪೆಸಿಮನ್ ರೆಕಾರ್ಡೆಡ್ ವಿತ್ ದ ಬ್ಯಾಂಕ್ ಸೊ ಒಬ್ಬ ಕಸ್ಟಮರು ಬ್ಯಾಂಕಲ್ಲಿ ಅಕೌಂಟನ್ನು ಓಪನ್ ಮಾಡಿದಾಗ ತ್ರೀ ಸಿಗ್ನೇಚರ್ಸ್ ಮಾಡಿಸ್ಕೊಂಡಿದ್ದಾರೆ ಯಾಕಂದರೆ ಸ್ವಲ್ಪ ವೇರಿಯೇಷನ್ ಇದ್ದರೂ ಕೂಡ ಅಟ್ಲೀಸ್ಟ್ ಮೂರು ಸಿಗ್ನೇಚರ್ ಒಂದೇ ಥರ ಕಾಣಬೇಕು ಅಂತ ಹೇಳಿ ವೆನ್ ಎವರ್ ಎ ಕಸ್ಟಮರ್ ಡ್ರಾಸ್ ಎ ಚೆಕ್ ಯು ವಿಲ್ ಆಲ್ಸೋ ಪುಟ್ ಇ ಸಿಗ್ನೇಚರ್ ಮೊದಲು ಸಿಗ್ನೇಚರ್ ಪ್ರೆಸೆಂಟ್ ಇರಬೇಕು ಚೆಕ್ ಮೇಲೆ ನಂಬರ್ ಒನ್ ನಂಬರ್ ಟು ದಟ್ ಸಿಗ್ನೇಚರ್ ಮಾಸ್ ಟ್ಯಾಲಿ ವಿತ್ ದ ಸ್ಪೆಸಿಮನ್ ಸಿಗ್ನೇಚರ್ ವಿಚ್ ಇಸ್ ರೆಕಾರ್ಡೆಡ್ ವಿತ್ ದ ಬ್ಯಾಂಕ್ ಒಂದು ವೇಳೆ ಅದು ಸ್ಪೆಸಿಮನ್ ಸಿಗ್ನೇಚರ್ಗೆ ಟ್ಯಾಲಿ ಆಗಲಿಲ್ಲ ಅಂದರೆ ಬ್ಯಾಂಕರ್ ಕ್ಯಾನ್ ಡಿಸಾನರ್ ದ ಚೆಕ್ ನೌ ದ ಚೆಕ್ ಮಸ್ಟ್ ಆಲ್ಸೋ ಬಿ ಡ್ರಾನ್ ಆನ್ ದ ಬ್ರೇ ಬ್ರಾಂಚ್ ವೇರ್ ದ ಅಕೌಂಟ್ ಈಸ್ ಮೇಂಟೈನ್ ದಟ್ಸ್ ವಾಟ್ ಐ ಸೆಟ್ ಇಫ್ ಐ ಹ್ಯಾವ್ ಎನ್ ಅಕೌಂಟ್ ಅಟ್ ಎಸ್ ಬಿ ಎಂ ಕೋಲಾರ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಐ ಪ್ರೆಸೆಂಟ್ ಎ ಚೆಕ್ ಇನ್ ಎಸ್ ಬಿ ಎಂ ಬ್ಯಾಂಗ್ಳೂರ್ ಮೈಸೂರು ಬ್ಯಾಂಕ್ ಬ್ರಾಂಚ್ ಪ್ರಾಬಬಲಿ ದಟ್ ಬ್ರಾಂಚ್ ವಿಲ್ ಡಿಸಾನರ್ ಮೈ ಚೆಕ್ ಯಾಕೆ ಅಂತ ಹೇಳಿದರೆ ಐ ಆಮ್ ಸಪೋಸ್ ಟು ಪ್ರೆಸೆಂಟ್ ಮೈ ಚೆಕ್ ವೇರ್ ಐ ಹೋಲ್ಡ್ ದ ಅಕೌಂಟ್ ನನ್ನ ಅಕೌಂಟ್ ಎಲ್ಲಿ ಹೋಲ್ಡ್ ಆಗಿದೆ ಹೋಲ್ಡ್ ಮಾಡಿದ್ದಾರೆ ಅಂದರೆ ಕಸ್ಟಮರ್ ಎಲ್ಲಿ ಅಕೌಂಟ್ ಇಟ್ಕೊಂಡಿತ್ತನೋ ಅಲ್ಲೇ ಚೆಕ್ಕನ್ನು ಪ್ರೆಸೆಂಟ್ ಮಾಡಬೇಕಾಗತ್ತೆ ಬಟ್ ನವ್ ಎ ಡೇಸ್ ಬ್ಯಾಂಕ್ಸ್ ಆರ್ ಅಡಾಪ್ಟೆಡ್ ಬ್ಯಾಂಕ್ಸ್ ಹ್ಯಾವ್ ಅಡಾಪ್ಟೆಡ್ ದ ಟೆಕ್ನಾಲಜಿ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ದರ್ ಇಸ್ ಸಮಥಿಂಗ್ ಕಾಲ್ ಎಸ್ ಎ ಕೋರ್ ಬ್ಯಾಂಕಿಂಗ್ ಕಾನ್ಸೆಪ್ಟ್ ಸೊ ವಿಚ್ ಇಸ್ ಎನೇಬಲಿಂಗ್ ದ ಕಸ್ಟಮರ್ಸ್ ಟು ಪ್ರೆಸೆಂಟ್ ದ ಚೆಕ್ಸ್ ಇನ್ ಅದರ್ ಬ್ಯಾಂಕ್ಸ್ ಆಲ್ಸೋ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಎನ್ ಕ್ಯಾಶ್ ಇಟ್ ಯಾಕೆ ಅಂತ ಹೇಳಿದರೆ ಆ ಸ್ಪೆಸಿಮನ್ ಸಿಗ್ನೇಚರು ಅಕೌಂಟ್ ಸ್ಟೇಟಸನ್ನು ಬೇರೆ ಬ್ರಾಂಚಲ್ಲಿ ಥ್ರೂ ಆನ್ಲೈನ್ ದೇ ಕ್ಯಾನ್ ಕಂಪೇರ್ ದೇ ಕ್ಯಾನ್ ಚೆಕ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ದೇ ಕ್ಯಾನ್ ಮೇಕ್ ದ ಚೆಕ್ ಹಾನರ್ ಸೊ ಅದರ್ವೈಸ್ ಇಟ್ ಈಸ್ ನಾಟ್ ಕಂಪಲ್ಸರಿ ಆನ್ ದ ಪಾರ್ಟ್ ಆಫ್ ದ ಬ್ಯಾಂಕ್ಸ್ ಅಗೈನ್ ಅಂದರೆ ಕೋರ್ ಬ್ಯಾಂಕಿಂಗ್ ಇದೆ ಅನ್ನೋ ಕಾರಣಕ್ಕೆ ನಾವು ಇನ್ಯಾವುದೋ ಬ್ರಾಂಚಲ್ಲಿ ಪ್ರೆಸೆಂಟ್ ಮಾಡಿ ವಿ ಕೆ ನಾಟ್ ಡಿಮ್ಯಾಂಡ್ ಫಾರ್ ದ ಪೇಮೆಂಟ್ ಇಟ್ ಈಸ್ ಡಿಪೆಂಡಿಂಗ್ ಆನ್ ದ ಬ್ಯಾಂಕ್ ಇಫ್ ಇಟ್ ಮೈಂಡ್ಸ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಇಫ್ ಇಟ್ ಇಸ್ ಗಾಟ್ ದ ಕೋರ್ ಬ್ರಾ ಬ್ಯಾಂಕಿಂಗ್ ಫೆಸಿಲಿಟಿ ದೆನ್ ಇಟ್ ಕ್ಯಾನ್ ಹಾನರ್ ದ ಚೆಕ್ಸ್ ಇನ್ ದ ಅದರ್ ಬ್ರಾಂಚಸ್ ಆಲ್ಸೋ ಬಟ್ ಜನರಲಿ ದ ಕಸ್ಟಮರ್ ಹ್ಯಾಸ್ ಟು ಪ್ರೆಸೆಂಟ್ ದ ಚೆಕ್ ಫಾರ್ ಪೇಮೆಂಟ್ ಇನ್ ದ ಬ್ರಾಂಚ್ ವೇರ್ ಈ ಈಸ್ ಹೋಲ್ಡಿಂಗ್ ದ ಅಕೌಂಟ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ದ ಸೆಕೆಂಡ್ ರಿಕ್ವೈರ್ಮೆಂಟ್ ಈಸ್ ದಟ್ ದೇರ್ ಈಸ್ ಎ ಸಫಿಷಿಯೆಂಟ್ ಬ್ಯಾಲೆನ್ಸ್ ಇನ್ ದ ಅಕೌಂಟ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ದ ಬ್ಯಾಲೆನ್ಸ್ ಈಸ್ ಪ್ರಾಪರ್ಲಿ ಅಪ್ಲಿಕಬಲ್ ಫಾರ್ ಪೇಮೆಂಟ್ ಆಫ್ ದ ಚೆಕ್ ದರ್ ಆರ್ ಟೂ ಆಸ್ಪೆಕ್ಟ್ಸ್ ಇನ್ ದಿಸ್ ಪಾಯಿಂಟ್ ಮೊದಲನೇದಾಗಿ ವೆನ್ ಎವರ್ ವಿ ಚೆ ಪ್ರೆಸೆಂಟ್ ದ ಚೆಕ್ ಫಾರ್ ಪೇಮೆಂಟ್ ಅದರಲ್ಲಿ ಸಫಿಷಿಯೆಂಟ್ ಬ್ಯಾಲೆನ್ಸ್ ಇರಬೇಕು ಸೇ ಫಾರ್ ಎಕ್ಸಾಂಪಲ್ ಇವ್ ಆವ್ ರಿಟರ್ನ್ ಚೆಕ್ ಫಾರ್ ಫಿಫ್ಟಿ ತೌಸಂಡ್ ರುಪೀಸ್ ಅಕೌಂಟಲ್ಲಿ ಫಿಫ್ಟಿ ತೌಸಂಡ್ ರುಪೀಸ್ ಮಿನಿಮಮ್ ಇರಲೇಬೇಕು ಒಂದು ರೂಪಾಯಿ ಕಡಿಮೆ ಇದ್ದರೂ ಕೂಡ ಬ್ಯಾಂಕು ಡಿಸಾನರ್ 
but that uh, all that is not the banking business hours. Business hours may be between 10 to 4, 10 to 2, 10 to 5 depending on that particular bank's practice. A particular bank who in practice it koni de, a time ola gade uh, checks anna now present maadhe kagatte. One vele after the office hours, that is the business hours, if we present the check, banker may not accept or may, may dishonor to honor the check. And there is something called as endorsement. What is this endorsement? If I have I have written check payable to Mr. X, Nanu X ge pay to Mr. X anta one the check na hatsa rupai bardi deni. I have given it to X. Let us assume X so hatsa rupai na vai korbe kagi rathe. Ili X so instead of going to the bank drawing the amount, I have check ko two hatsa rupai to gondu. Amel vai korak badalagi. A check na vai ge korta ne. So check na vai korta ga. A check transfer agbe kora. Check ko X S re lide. Hage vai korado. Adi ke namge endorsement to sahaya madte. What is this endorsement? If the X आवन ऐसे लग सदी के चक्की दे एक्सेल मरते नहीं फिर टर्न्स द चक चक हिंदी गड़े पे टू मिस्टर वाई अंतर बर दो एक्स सिग्नेचर है ना मार देखो ये का एक्स वाई के चक का ना ट्रांसफर मरता है जाने हाउ बाय पुटिंग ए सिग्नेचर एट द बैक ऑफ द चक दिस इज कॉल्ड एस एंडर्समेंट आदरे ये एंडर्समेंट कोड़ा the banker can dishonor the check. Hagagi, whenever a customer is endorsing the check to somebody else, he must make a regular and proper endorsement. And the next point where banker can dishonor the check is the payment of the check is not countermanded by the drawer. There are certain situations where the drawer himself, yaru check kana barita dhani, say previous example to go thani, ega nanu exige check kana koti in hatsa rupai ge. याव तो कारण अगले इंदर नानी के आमे लंच होता है एक्सी के दूध कोड़ बार दोन ता ये निर्भर होता है मोस्टली एक्सी के नाच्चा और पच्चा कोड़ते नहीं हाथ्चा और पाय दो याव तो उन वस्तु नानी के तन कोड़ा के लेते नहीं नाले पड़ेगे और गड़े नानी के तन कोड़ो वस्तु ना हाथ्चा और पाने ने कैश what should I do now? I can call my banker. Anu, namma banker ke call marthi ni. Stop the payment on the check issued to so and so. Check number do, matte check date to ella details kot pirti ni. Now what I am doing? My this action is called as a countermanding of the check. If the drawer himself asks the banker to stop the payment on the check, that is called as a countermanding of the check. This is this may be done for various reasons. You can quote it one example. Is there are many reasons the the customer or the drawer of the bank check may himself ask the bank to stop the payment on the check. That is called as the countermanding. After the countermanding of the check, if the holder of the check check को नहीं बगैर तो दे x तर है तो x y कोटे तो y तर रहते आओ नो check तो कौन उधर बैंक को डिजाइनर मारते या क्या इंतेले तर है कस्टमर अंदर या यारों चक्कर ना बर्दी दाने आउने ने अमाउंट अना कोट बेड़ी अंत हेली दाने काउंटर मैन मारी दाने होगा कि ना वो अमाउंट अना पे मारता है लांता हेल्थ सो दिस इस दिस इस दिस इस एन अदर एक्शन वेयर बैंकर कैन डिजाइनर द चेक नाउ दिस वेरी इम्पोर्टेंट सिचुएशन वेयर बैंकर कैन आल्सो डिजाइनर द � Countermand of the payment वंदु, notice of customer's death अंदरे, यारो चक्कन्ना draw माड़े दाने, आवेक्ती थीर कोंड़ी दिरे, अधर बग्ये proper mode इंद बैंक अर्गे information बंदी दिरे, on the receipt of information about the customer's death, bank will stop the payment on the check, hence he will dishonor the check, वंद वेले, customer death आगिदे, but in bank अर्गे information गोत्तिल्ला, in ignorance of the customer's death, Banker may honor, आदरे, banker गमनक्के बंदरे, if the banker comes to know about the death of the customer, he must dishonor the check. वन वले, customer death बगे गोत्तिद्धू honor माडिदरे, banker is liable for the loss happened to the legal representative of the deceased customer. तीर्कोंडिरो customer सु, legal representatives बेकादरे, banker मेले, केसर आपपोदू. Next to, notice of customer's mental incapacity. Sometimes it so happens, a customer draws the check, 
give it to somebody else yargo kottidane in the due course that particular customer uh, becomes mentally disordered athwa incapacitated avanu lunatic aagabodu athwa avanu eds aagabodu for various reasons aagirabodu anta time alli adr bage information customer mental incapacity bage information bandru kuda banker immediate agi avanu draw madirthakanta ella checks mele payments anna stop madbekagutte that is other also one of the situations where he cannot honor the customer's checks and very very important is on service of a garnishee order there is something called as a garnishee order which is issued by the court and on the issue of the on the receipt of the garnishee order banker garnishee order na receive madidda takshana checks na designer madbekagutte now let us see what is uh, exactly this garnishee order is okay the obligation of the banker to honor his customer's check is extinguished means stopped on receipt of an order of the court known as garnishee order which is issued under order 21 rule 46 of the code of civil procedure 1908 what is what exactly the garnishee order is it is the order obtained by a judgment creditor we are getting uh, different terms here by a judgment creditor against the judgment debtor and the third party is a garnishee now as far as the banker and customer is concerned who is the garnishee who is the judgment debtor and who is the judgment creditor now when the order is served on a bank in respect of the money held in a customer's bank account say for example x, x is the customer of a of sbm kolar anta ittkolana illi x is the customer the bank the third party and x yaro y ge sala kodbekagirutte adre kottirodilla y x mele bank alli court alli case hakirtane here y is called as the third party who is the garnishee or is the judgment debtor avanu judgment garnishee aagtane judgment creditor aagtane y is the judgment creditor x is the judgment debtor and the banker is the garnishee ille en martane x u y ge hana kodbekagirutte but failure default agirtane y goes to the court of law tells the court that x has got money in the bank illi bank u matte x eno bank is the creditor bank is the debtor and x is the creditor andre x u bank galli deposit maadittidane adhe x u y ge dud kodbeku refuse maadittane y helutte y court ge hogbittu heltane nanage x account alli irthakanta bank alli iradudu nanage kodsi anta so on the request of the y y is your judgment creditor on the request of y court issues an order to the garnishee third party illi third party yaro andre bank yakandre bank gu y gu yavade sambandha illa x and y madde contract agide ee x matte y contract ge sambandha pattanga bank is a third party illi bank is the uh, debtor of the judgment creditor ಸೊ ಇಲ್ಲಿ ಏನು ಮಾಡ್ತಾರೆ ಅಂದರೆ ಬ್ಯಾಂಕುಗೆ ಕೋರ್ಟು ಆರ್ಡರ್ನ ಪಾಸ್ ಮಾಡುತ್ತೆ ನಿಮ್ಮ ಅಕೌಂಟು ಐ ಮೀನ್ ನಿಮ್ಮ ಕ್ರೆಡಿಟಾರ್ ಇದ್ದಾನಲ್ಲ ನಿಮ್ಮ ಕಸ್ಟಮರ್ ಅವನ ಅಕೌಂಟನ್ನು ಸ್ಟಾಪ್ ಮಾಡಿ ಯಾಕೆ ಅಂತ ಹೇಳಿದರೆ ಆ ಅಮೌಂಟನ್ನು ನೀವು ಸ್ಟಾಪ್ ಮಾಡಿ ಅದನ್ನು ಜಡ್ಜ್ಮೆಂಟ್ ಕ್ರೆಡಿಟಾರ್ಗೆ ಪೇ ಮಾಡಿ ಅಂತ ಸೊ ದಿಸ್ ಈಸ್ ಕಾಲ್ಡ್ ಆಸ್ ಅನ್ ಗಾರ್ನಿಶಿ ಆರ್ಡರ್ ಸೊ ಲೆಟ್ ಅಸ್ ಡಿಸ್ಕಸ್ ಗಾರ್ನಿಶಿ ಆರ್ಡರ್ ಇನ್ ಡೀಟೈ